Nigeria Customs Service in Kaduna State has made seizure of unregistered vehicles and medicine to the tune of about 236 billion naira, ranging from April to June 2022. The revenue generating body says the fate was achieved through information gathering and cooperation among relevant government agency. Plus TV correspondent Habila Daufari files this report. Over the years, illegal importations and smuggling of substandard products into the country has been a major challenge facing the federal government. This economic setback has discouraged local producers from producing products leading to losses in millions of naira. The Comptroller of the Customs Service in Kaduna says seized items include rice, maize, petrol, textile, unregistered vehicles, used tires and medicine. The idea of seizing this uh, product is to give way to the production of same item locally here in Nigeria. The federal government is only them decided to, 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 to give certain incentives to Nigerians who wish to produce this thing here in Nigeria. And I don't think we should allow foreign items, similar items to compete with the ones that are produced here locally. So we don't allow it to come and uh, wherever we see it, uh, we, we stop it from circulating. He complains that continuous smuggling of contraband into country by concealment was an economic crime and putting the lives of Nigerians at risk. He appealed to importers to use their proper channels that the customs service will always make offenders face the wrath of the law. Uh, the federal government, its own wisdom, and for control purpose, decided to restrict importation of motor vehicles through the port and airport. This is for control and statistic reason. Uh, what we have here is, is, I can say, is a Western investment. If the owner feels, though he can, can ask questions from customs, he can easily get the correct information that will not allow him to waste his investment like this. Motor vehicles are not allowed to come through border stations. They are allowed to come only through ports and airports. Uh, when we get them, some of them will claim as if they have documents. But for, for us to be fair to them, we keep it for them to bring the document for, the, for us to verify. He also asked patriotic Nigerians to support the fight against illegal importations and smuggling. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.